All right, we've got the leader of the Chico's Patty Berg Memorial, Grace Na, a rookie on the Symmetra Tour after round one, five under, 67. Great day, no bogeys, five birdies. Tell us about it. I think I just had a lot of fun. Um, and my son kind of were both God because I didn't have a caddy today. So I was just talking to myself, and he was like the perfect caddy, you know. And um, I just made sure I just hung in there and just stayed focused. Being the last few times is always tough, but... Um, I had a great group. It was a lot of fun out there. Any highlights, any long putts, any big moments, any sort of moments that turned around your round or got it got you really going? I think 16 and 18 was probably two good holes for me. On 16, I hit it in the middle of the fairway, but I'm in divots. And I've been facing divots all day, and, you know, you would think you have good karma. But um, I just had a really good up and down after that bad, bad break. And the last hole, I was, I want to say, about 195 out. Into the wind, I was like, I'm not even going to – get to the green so just rip a five wood and just get up and down and I stick it to three feet and my playing partners are like you didn't look very happy after that I was like I thought I had no chance but it was a, it was just a good day for me mm -hmm. how about the feeling I mean you're a rookie only a few events on the Symmetra tour and you know this is one of the bigger events on tour and you know after 18 holes you're at the top of the leaderboard is it a pretty good feeling for you uh, it's an awesome feeling, but, you know, it's only the first round, and golf's golf. I mean, put me in any tournament, it's the same golf course in the same game. And so I just want to enjoy myself out there every chance I get. Tell us your story, Grace, because you really just graduated from, from Pepperdine in December. You were playing Q School sort of while you were finishing up, and now you're professional. Sort of give us a sense of what the last maybe half a year has been like for you. Uh, it's been very up and down. Um, I had a pretty decent college career and going to Q school, it was the little little tadpole again all over. And um, I was just taking time to just mature and, you know, get my feet wet. So um, nothing crazy. I just love the game and every bit of it I enjoy, ups and downs. Professional life, professional golfer, what, what does that mean to you? Is it, is it sort of a, is it a good feeling to be a pro now? Well, that means no homework, <laughs> no finals, nothing to email professors, which is awesome. Um, so I, it's nice just to focus on just golf and I have a good uh, travel buddy and, you know, she's taught me a lot over the past couple of weeks. And so, I mean, the pro life's awesome. It's definitely a grind, don't get me wrong, but I mean, we're blessed, you know, to be out here. All right, so you've got the lead. You'll sleep on the lead, obviously, 54 holes still to go. What will be sort of your mindset heading into the rest of the week? Um, just stay humble and just stay in the moment. Um, anything can happen. And so I just want to, you know, just play some golf out there and see what, you know, see what God has in store for me. All right, well, great job, and thanks a lot. Thank you.